All right. Ah. Oh. My camera like gets really dark. I um <laughs> Dude, that fucking scratch motherfucker dude. Holy shit. He was annoying. And when I couldn't get Saga to reload or anything, she was like I don't know, stuck in syrup or something. I don't know. It was Dog shit. <laughs> I don't know what happened, dude. But the small thing to do would would be to I don't know. Sometimes when I have the light on him, reload. Other times heal, go get ammo. Don't go for the light on every occasion you get. Maybe move around a bit. I'm not sure when he did that fucking attack thing though. If we were supposed to like double those up, I don't know. Or just run. <laughs> oh, oh. I don't know. But anyways, let's jump into the next part and see how what's happening, dude. We might be pretty fuck we're pretty fucking close to the end, but I don't know how close. Maybe this is I don't know. Let's see though. Way less screaming this time. Rock and roll, Tom, baby. We need to get to our next <laughs> gig. We're doing this for you and our lovely saga. You take care of things on this side. They're Don't going screw in. It up, Tom. I'd seen it all play out. Like a horror movie I'd been forced to watch. The dark presence held all the cards now. What's happening now? Old gods of Asgard, dude. I present to you. What a fucking rock show, dude. I got so pissed. I was so irritated. Like, I wasn't... Calavella Knight's jacket. I wasn't really... I wasn't playing it right. In the beginning, I guess, but then, then, then uh, there was something wrong with Saga, dude. I um, God, that was fucking fun, though. Last episode. Welcome back, Wake. Thank you. Are you. Awake now, right, with the shadow yeah. out of you. Yeah, I think. Yeah. Some good news, at least. Bad news is I haven't seen a situation this fucked since the AWE in Eagle River. The shadow's now in Alex, and Anderson is gone. We need to figure out how to salvage this. I fucking hope we get Anderson back, dude. Like, Saga, what the fuck? No way. She has to come back, dude. What the fuck, man? I'll do anything it takes to fix this, Agent <sighs> Estevez. I'm the reason this is all happening. It's never that simple. But I should have put you in a box and shipped you off to a containment facility the second I laid eyes on you. The only question now is... Are you able to fix this? I can try. Not the most encouraging answer, but we'll make it work. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Scratch. The dark presence inside Casey. It drew Saga into the lake. If she ends up in the dark place, she could be there forever. It took me 13 years to get out. Oh. Zane never did. Tor and Odin went in after her, right? Maybe they'll get her out. With the power of rock and roll. Don't be funny, I saw no. them when I was trapped there. They performed in my musical. I'm immediately <laughs> less optimistic about this. <laughs> it was a great musical, though. What's the situation? I've never seen an entity break a bureau containment unit like that. And now the Dark Presence is occupying Agent Casey? No. Oh. When it attacked him in the woods, it must have been preparing for this. And now he is the clicker. Did you think that... The Dark Presence were going to take Casey? I don't know, well. Huh? I don't know what I thought, dude. 
Scratch will go to Bright Falls and use the clicker to bring about the horrific ending he wrote for Return. But I can still fix this. How? Scratch must have the manuscript. If I can read the ending, I can rewrite it. I need to go after him. <sighs> well, you won't get very far without these. This plan is a real Hail Mary wake. I wish I could help, but this is all on you. I got you every kind of weapon we have available. <laughs> Don't fuck it up. Yeah, you see how I am with weapons? I I, I suck. I fucking suck. I needed too. a car. The FBI vehicle would be at the parking lot. Jesus. Oof. Alan Wake. This place is fucking beautiful though. I've never been that engaged in a, like, a, I don't know, boss. I've, I've been uh, annoyed a couple of times in Elden Ring, I guess. And this is way easier than Elden Ring. But I'm a tired old man. <laughs> oh my god, dude. Look at the bus. It's... It's... <laughs> what's this bus? Oh... Oh, that last episode was dog shit too. Too much screaming. Well, I didn't get a lot of ammunition. Some, I guess. I gotta play through this again sometime and uh, do better. <laughs> what a fucking ride, though. So where are we supposed to go? I mean, how... Uh, how uh, parking lot, we have to go... Uh, I don't have... I don't have a map, though. Oof. Estimus, I'm gonna fix this, but where's the road? We're going this way, right? Oh, I was awake again. Clear-headed for the first time in what felt like a lifetime. Alan awake. Yeah, I was back years. exactly where I left. A dark forest outside Bright Falls. A gun in one hand, a flashlight in the other. Haunted by my own writing. Alice taken from me. I knew what I had to do. Stop the horror story from coming true. Stop the dark presence. But is, is Alice... Is she dead? Or is she... Is that just... Oh my god, dude. <laughs> what a game. What a fucking game. No break. What is this? I was... Did you see I was holding my light on him and it didn't... Didn't work out for me. It's uh, I wonder if the sensitivity is low while I knew, or maybe I'm just a bad aim, dude. I probably have to aim better. God, dude, this shit, dude. Usually, I like if if I die and stuff in games or having a hard time. Usually, I'm just laughing, but. I don't know, I got so in uh, into it. Fuck, dude. I got a little pissed, just like Alan Wake. Bad tempo. Yeah, there she is. Oh, shivers. Volcanic gas? Oh, 
Ow. What did I do now, though? Maybe, maybe it's... Uh... <laughs> maybe it's bedtime. <laughs> maybe it's bedtime. Might be bedtime. That was bad. I was like looking for her head, her head for like two, three seconds and I missed. Mm. He fell. That was funny. <laughs> Holy moly. Might be bad time, dude. What am I doing? Like, seriously, what am I doing? Shooting wobbly hats. Could be a problem. This isn't usually a problem, right? Have... It's been a long day. Long day. Long fucking day. All right, let's see. Oh, it's like nothing else. <laughs> okay. This is the wrong way, I don't remember the way, dude. Oh my god, I thought...
general stop. I'm getting my ass kicked in this game tonight, dude. <laughs> I'm... I think I'm too tired. I'm too fucking tired, man. I'm, uh... Nothing is working. I feel like the controls are too slow. But that's probably just my brain. Oh. Holy shit, dude. What was that though? That was what? <laughs> I just have to break through. It's just coming more and more. <laughs> My God! Didn't I complain earlier that there weren't enough uh, enemies? I think I did. <laughs> Fuck me, dude. It's not great. A game is really fucking good when it, it makes you feel shit. You get a little angry, you get a little happy, you get a little sad. Get engaged. Oh my god. In the dark place, the dark That's presence went cool. into me. When I was pulled back here, crossing over and weakened it, made it dormant. I couldn't remember what had happened, but I could feel it getting stronger, waking up. I thought it was haunting me, closing in. It was inside me the whole time, and then it took over. It turned me into Scratch. Oh, damn. Fucking Scratch, dude. <laughs> Pure fucking evil, that one. Oh. <laughs> fucking Scratch. And now Casey, huh? Now Casey, dude. This is just sick. Oh, 
Come on, Alan. <laughs> no doing me like that, bro. I had to get to Bright Falls. See this through to the end. All right. Oh, so good, I this brought game. Saga Anderson into this story to help me escape. She succeeded. It cost her everything. I'd used Alex Casey in my writing for years. The real Casey had been drawn here because of that. Now he was a victim too. Saga, <laughs> Casey, Alice, all this horror originates from me. It's my fault. Scratch had to be stopped. Only I've driven down this road before. Been driving on it forever. Yeah. <laughs> My God. If Scratch had brought the dark place here, this would take me back inside. In 2010, I had dived in. A leap of faith <laughs> for Alice. Yeah. With no idea that the cost would be a nightmare worse than death. Ooh. It had taken me 13 years to get out. Now Alice was dead. Is she dead? Is she dead? Uh... Leap again, this time knowing the cost all too well. Is she? Another way to look at it? I had brought the dark place here with me. I never had gotten out. Maybe after this, I finally could. Is this the end? The dog we getting? I, don't know. I had no choice. I had to Free. do it. That didn't make me any less terrified. You'll see. Fuck it. Yeah, fuck it. Look at that super duper uh, mega edition uh, suit though. I don't wake a tomb. Dear first. The this is not what I expected. No. <laughs> what the fuck? Explore Bright Falls? What? Stage fight scene and departure is one up by the absolutely mind frying Dark Ocean Summoning. <laughs> the masks, dude. Wake deftly tricks the reader into believing the cult of the tree is the story's antagonist. <laughs> I feel so bad for screaming in the last episode. Setting the trilogy's exciting conclusion at Deerfest uh. makes return a genre bending mixture of fact and fiction. You look. The latest novel, Return, is breaking every literary record in existence. It's the great American novel. Do you like to read? I'm not big on reading. I I, I should probably stop reading, but I, I don't like it a lot. <laughs> I needed to get a copy of Return. I needed to read the ending to have a shot at changing it. I was inside Scratch's ending, a perverse version of reality. The townspeople brainwashed. Everyone and everything revolved around return. Yeah, that's a bit strange. It had just been published.
We have to go over there, dude. And what about the lime and the coconut, though? Hello, I'm Ilma Koskova, and welcome to the Koskova Brothers Book Club. This week, we will review the highly anticipated new novel by Alan Wake, Return. Return is printed on a firm, high-quality, white offset, uncoated paper stock, making every page a true delight to turn in your fingertips. Alan Wake's brilliance is on full display with his choice of a hardcover book jacket. <laughs> made of a premium enamel stock with gloss lamination that is both tasteful and pleasant to the touch. Isn't that right? Oh. <laughs> Wake set a high standard with his previous novels, but I can say without hesitation that Return contains the best and most compelling book description on a back cover that I have ever read. This book blurb is truly riveting and will keep you on the edge of your seat from start to finish. Just like this game. It is accompanied by a tasteful photograph of Alan Wake's home here in Bright Falls. The what? Book is one pound and three ounces. <clears throat> Return is a true the Wait. <laughs> I'll give it a perfect score of five Alma beers out of five. How about you? There you have it. Alan Wake has done it again. This was the Costco Brothers Book Club. Cheers. The Coastal Brothers achievements. We watched probably. We probably watched all the shows. Oh my God! What a fucking ride, though. This game, dude. There's no liming in the coconut. Sold out? Of course it's... Of course it's sold out. Why wouldn't it be? Wake definitely tricks the reader into believing the cult of the tree is the story's antagonist. Coffee! Is our dear author planning something for I haven't had coffee tonight. I don't know how they Setting the trilogy's exciting conclusion at Deerfest. Oh, Lake's return. Is that her, man? A bending mixture of fact and fiction. And Mandy May? Norman, I mean. I understand what was going on half the time, but I loved him. Hey guys. The old gods of Asgard are back. Wake clearly knows what his fans want to see. Where do I sign up to live in the Valhalla Hello. <clears throat> I 
I could see the round windows of the writer's room in the photo. That's where I had to go. To rewrite the ending of Return. It's a sick, sick story. Shit. Oh. In a loop. <laughs> what? <laughs> I'm so tired. Round windows of the writer's room in the photo. That's where I had to go. To I want to finish it. Turn. It's a sick, sick story. And I love it. Whoa. Like if there's a place I can die, I'll die. I had the book now. I could write my ending to return. I had to get to the writer's room to stop this horror story. This was an obsessive, egocentric mm -hmm. nightmare. <clears throat> All revolving around a vain monster of a writer and his final divine work of art. The novel return come true. It wouldn't stop here. Oh. It would keep spreading. In the manor house, I reached the writer's room. Write a new conclusion. Was Scratch's insecure need for fame, for praise, drawn from my psyche? I would bring his sick fantasy crashing down around him. Dude, Alan, I... So, where is Rose now? <laughs> Oh my god, this game, dude. I had to find another way inside. Maybe I should turn on the volume. I'm, I'm probably uh, ruining my hearing. I don't have anything. Ooh. I had to find another way inside. Basement was a dumb idea. The garden smelled like roses. Couldn't go there. Not really sure where I can go. I have to go through this building. I don't really want to do that though. Oh my god, dude. Alice? What was that? Alice was dead. Was this a trap? Or was Scratch torturing me? Do you think she's really that dead? I don't know. I really don't know. So. Yeah, Alan, you should have seen me chasing Tool down here. It's a hell of a ride. I'm not sure anymore which way. This is the wrong way. Oh. Alice. Yeah.
They kind of tricked me. I don't know what happened there, dude. What the fuck happened there, dude? <laughs> that was stupid. It, I kind of turned the wrong way. Or... Oh my god. Oh, no. Fuck you, Scratch. Fucking asshole. Shit, Scratch! Oh, we're gonna die, dude. Oh, we're so gonna die. We're gonna die. We're gonna die. We're gonna die. We're going to die. I should have just... Go, go, go! Rose? You're still here? You're safe in the light, Alan. For now. But he's very pushy. Rose, <laughs> right? From the diner. How are you here? I'm here to save you, silly. I got your instructions. I found every hidden message you left for me. In the radio, in the wind, in the forums on my Alan Wake fan site. What? No, Rose, I haven't been leaving you any messages. Oh, I get it. Yes, Alan, only a crazy person would think you've been leaving them secret messages. <laughs> Wink. But now you need to get your butt upstairs, Alan. This shit won't write itself, no matter what William Shakespeare said. I don't right. think you said that. Though. Thank you, Rose. I'll do what I can. <laughs> uh. Upstairs, the writer's room must be in the attic. That's where the windows were. Oh my god, dude. <laughs> rocking around the rocking chair. Oh. What's up? They loop around and come to Keter, Tom. Tom. I have put everything ready for the visitors. I'll come to wash the floor of your room next. All you need is water and pileda. Water is the oldest pulp. Water finds its way. What water brings, it takes away. It can be clean or dirty. It can give life or drown it. Akti, I didn't expect to see you here, but it makes sense. Can you help me find my way? One last time. Mm, now there's a devil in the fish trap. Don't be spooked by it so that shit won't start beating your underpants. Okay, I'll get the door open for you, Tom. There you go. The matter is a stake. <laughs> Did you, uh... Now comes the end of the rhyme. Did you, you know earlier that this was the writing room? I did not. I tried to go into that room, a saga, but Arty stopped me. I was here. I needed to write the ending. I only had one chance to get this right. Okay. I don't know if this is a good idea, but... 40 minutes, yo. I think we're, um, I was kind of thinking maybe this was the last episode, but I think we're aiming for one more. How long it will be, we, I don't know. <laughs>
Right, okay. Again, though, thank you for being here. Thank you for watching. Thank you if you liked something. Thank you if you subscribed. Welcome if you subscribed. And yeah, have a great fucking day. Stay cool.